Okay, this is the first fire up of the uh, Micro SDX HF transceiver, all mode 8 band. And it is um, all mode and it is 8 bands. Um, I have seen 6 meters come up in the display. I'm not too sure if uh, that's right, but definitely 10 to 160. It's currently on 40 meters. Um, it's going to take some getting used to, but there does seem to be a lot of features in this tiny little package. Um, it's a speaker mic, as you can see. It's uh, it's not it's not going to be uh, the the best fidelity in the world. I've just connected it up, so we're on 40 meters. It's I haven't got the tuner tuned in, so I'm not going to risk transmitting and breaking it from the get go. But um, to drive it, well, you can see the display for a start. Some people were saying about the display. Display is fine for me. It's big enough. It's very readable. Um, once again, you know, uh, it, it, you know the, the features that are there, you, you drive it from the menu. For instance, if we go into the menu, you can see the tune rate. We can go down to one hertz right up to one meg tuning rate. Um, and there we can see we're, we're altering it there so uh, let's come out of that one ok um, we go right down to the uh, the bottom ok you start off with the volume uh, literally you press you, know, you press menu you alter the volume that's loud enough for me at the moment just for this demonstration We've got a mode, it does LSB, upper sideband, CW, AM, FM. I wasn't aware of the AM, FM. Um, uh, you've got filters. You've got the bands, obviously I've, I've mentioned the bands. Uh, the tuning rate, we've just mentioned the tuning rate. VFO, you've got A and B. Um, you've got the RIT, obviously for receive tuning only. Um, AGC, you've got it on fast because we're on SSB. Um, noise reduction, got it set to zero. Um, the attenuator set to zero dB. Uh, where are we? Attenuator two, S meter. Well, I'm reading dBm at the moment. I haven't gone into these features yet. I will go into them later. I'll do a, a more in depth video later. Um, your CW decoder, oh, that's a nice little feature there. Um, CW tone, obviously, for transmit. You can do a semi break. Uh, Kia speed, so it's got an automatic Kia, um, a Kia mode straight, so you can set it, you know, paddle straight, etc. Um, Kia swap, practice off, um, tone volume, uh, voice activated, you've got your noise gate, TX drive. I would imagine the 4 means it's set the 4 watts, TX delay. Um, the, basically, uh, this is a lot of this is for a CW because this is based on the uh, QCX um, transceiver from QRP Labs. But uh, CQ message, you can see someone's already programmed in uh, CQ PE1 NNN. I would imagine uh, you know you can uh, have a Kia to to send your message. I mean, cheating basically. Um, PA bias is at minimum. I'm going to look into this once again. I don't want to transmit and bust the output, although it probably wouldn't be expensive to replace. Um, uh, not too sure on the IQ phase, uh, backlight, self explanatory. So that's all of the uh, the menus. As I say, we're, um, we're listening to EW station. On the 7 135 lower side band. As I say, I've just powered it up. I've just made up the power lead. I've just powered it up. Um, I really have not uh, looked at the features or anything. You know, I've literally just powered it up, put the um, the video recorder on just to do a quick video and just to show you, you know, this thing is tiny. Yeah, absolutely tiny. But. Uh, yeah, you had to make up a power lead. The microphone, the speaker mic comes with it. And of course you need a BNC to um, uh, uh, SO239 uh, adapter on the back. Although I could probably just go straight into a, um, 
I could go straight into obviously uh, a PL2, for, uh, sorry, I could uh, put a BNC connector on the back. So I'm just, um, just, just making this on the fly. I literally wanted to power it up, make sure that it works, and then um, I'll come back to it later and uh, give a more in-depth report. But uh, yeah, it's, um, it's, you know, it is what it is. 100 quid's worth of HF all-mode transceiver. Whether it's any good, time will tell. Whether it's a pile of poo, time will tell. Really can't tell. But um, I'd expect it to be picking up a lot more on 40 metres. But once again, I haven't I haven't mucked about with any of the settings. Let's see if we can get him some volume on that. You go up too far and you get that noise. I found nine is probably so far the best volume, but no. I mean, it could be a deaf radio. I don't know. I say once again. You know, would you want for the money? It's a uh, it's a development radio at the end of the day. Anyway, I've waffled on for nearly seven minutes now. Ah, somebody was asking about um, eleven meters. That might be worth uh, just seeing if we can get there. Uh, We go to well, it does sixty meters, which is interesting. Of course, that's not for everyone. So, if we got a ten meters, come on. this before where are we come on we don't want six meters okay let's let's go down below 28 ah there you go 27 megahertz 11 meters whether it transmits on 11 meters who can tell we're on am at the moment it's probably no good to man or beast let's uh should have altered the step on this, shouldn't I, before before uh, twiddling this knob. So, let's see. Everyone's favourite. Look at this. Triple five. 27 triple five. I know we're sitting on AM at the moment. But, um, uh, which way is it? Upper side band. There we go. Twenty-seven triple five upper side band. Will it transmit there? I don't know. As I say, I'm I'm not set up for transmission at the moment, and don't want to wreck things before I've even got started. So I'm going to take me time over it. But there you go. Look, that, that that's it. It's the Micro STX HF transceiver, all mode eight band. Uh, I paid about a hundred quid for this one. It might have been a hundred quid very badly spent. It might also be uh, those that know me and have followed me know that I like me homebrew. I like me old gear. I like, you know, all me old crap and that. I mean, come on. I mean, this is, you know, this is what I've got in just this particular place. You know, I've got some old crap. I've been, um, I've been playing about with just recently, but, uh, yeah, that that is that is could be new crap. It could be the best thing since sliced bread. Anyway, waffle over. I've done a ten minute video. I've given you all the first look at these little transceiver. Uh, you, you pay your money, you take your choice. Me, I, I you know I, I, I'm pragmatic about it. I you know, you know I could have wasted hundred quid 
on lots of things that uh, and I have done, you know. But then again, maybe it's not a waste. We don't know yet. It's early days. But uh, I will be sure to uh, make another video and report back. Yakety yakety yak. Cheers.